where the meat industry is thriving and scientists are trying to find some sustainable ways to feed people. And Australian researchers claim that they've now come up with a way to turn marine microalgae into food. And the end result is not only sustainable and rich in nutrients, but can also be made to resemble your favourite dish. Our next report gets you the details. Global demand for meat is rising. Statistics show that the world is producing three times the quantity of meat as it did 50 years ago. While the meat industry is one of the most profitable, it is certainly not the most sustainable. Scientists have been working to find sustainable ways to feed people without having them cut down on protein. Some Australian scientists have found the answer in marine microalgae. Welcome to Adelaide's Flinders University. This strange looking red liquid is a superfood. We're able to manipulate the raw materials to mimic just about anything that's out there on the market. We just play with the textures and the flavours and we can find something that is attractive and palatable to most people. This lab-grown caviar requires only one ingredient from the ocean, microalgae. The algae is grown in the lab and cultivated into a solution. It is then manipulated into food form. The result is not only high in protein and nutrients, but also looks like the real caviar. Scientists can even control how it behaves after being eaten. I can pretty much fine tune it how long or how fast I want those nutrients to be released in my body according to my need. The big question is, what does the algae taste like? Scientists say it tastes like sea when it is raw, but any flavor can be added to it. From vegan patties to sandwich spreads, the algae is being tried in a number of different formats. This means that Australians could soon get their hands on an algae mite in their nearest supermarkets. Bureau Report, Vion, World is One. Vion is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.